Excitement enveloping everyone here because it is a huge occasion. The Champions League final. Who's going to be crowned Club Kings of Europe? It's PSG. They take on Milan next on EA TV. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It's Paris Saint-Germain, and they take on Milan. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. Toro Muani. Milan doing well to win it back. And the PSG team looks like this. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Milan Striniar plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Kylian Mbappe starts with Usman Dembele out wide. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Oh, big chance here, Derek. And he read it really well. Of defending. Well, you get the feeling so many in attendance here have come just to see this man, Kylian Mbappe. Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out the situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. Chukweze. Someone to play it to. Can he put it in? Oh, magnificent save! Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. What reaction from the goalkeeper that was. Trying to deliver it accurately. Not the best clearance. Just can't get it past him. Well, the corner right on the back of the last one. Well, capable of a better clearance than that. Spot on with that tackle. Room to run for PSG on the wing. Hakimi. Can he do it? And he scores! First goal in this season's UEFA Champions League final. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. Oh, this is looking promising. But a good piece of tidying up. Giroud. Really good build-up, but no end product. Will he finish? Well, here it is again, and how many times have we seen this in recent games? Teams trying to play out from the back, not doing it particularly well, giving away sloppy possession, and then getting punished. It's a really poor goal to concede. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Mbappe. Mbappe. Cuts it back. Chance maybe. He's having quite the game for himself. Save after save after save. Promising sequence. And he cuts in from the wing. 
tremendously strong in the tackle. Loftus cheek. Big chance. Well, that was off the cusp of saying he's at it again. Looked as though he might score again. Well, he's certainly looking sharp today. That could easily have been his second there. Corner kick played in. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. The super tackle, and they've won possession. Well, what a good save that was. Milan really should be in front now. That could prove to be a big moment in the game. Chukwueze. Can he put it away? Oh, that is an outrageously good stop. Well, great reflex from the keeper. He did brilliantly there. Who's going to get on the end of it? Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. <laughs> Unsuccessfully cut out. It's a promising Milan move. Pereira. Really getting stuck in. Giroud. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, they have to pay attention. And it was a good counter attack in the making, but very alert defending. Leal. Opportunity to deliver the cross. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Attacking possibilities for PSG. Conceded by Milan. Fine run from Mbappe. The supporters want to see him have a go and getting across to stop it. Dembele tasked with taking the corner. But he can't keep that effort on target and a goal kick it'll be. And the referee's whistle, we've reached the halfway point here at Wembley Stadium. So back underway here, into the second half. Threading it through. And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, as a defender, that will sink you down to the ground. It is a decent-looking attack here. Can he put them in front? He's blocked it! And it could be an opportunity for PSG to take the lead from a corner. Just too much height on that one. Close shave, though. Musa. 
And Milan moving the ball with purpose. Chukwueze. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Kylian Mbappe. Could be dangerous. this again the vision to play this through ball is superb and all you can do is admire the finish by Mbappe he hits the ball so cleanly it's a fantastic strike well that reaction says it all that's such an important goal in this game so Milan get the ball moving once more how will they react Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Rosso Neri pushing forward with options available. Giroud. And there the move ends for now. Now can they counter clinically? And showing fine vision. A wonderful counter attacking football. Just unfortunate that they didn't score. Well, had he scored, that would have been a great goal. The speed in which they changed from defence to attack was brilliant. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. It's a good-looking ball. Giroud. done and the advantage is with PSG he might be able to profit from the wide position Mbappe oh that's textbook goalkeeping and this might not be the ideal situation for them well body in the way Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick somebody out with that cutback. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So there it is. 3-1 the current scoreline here. Chukwueze. Milan moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Vitor Ferreira. Breaking at pace. Leal. Do they have the guile to up and up the defence? And there is the goal! Well, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. Well, they get the ball rolling, and Milan are believing again. Manuel Lugarte. Progress is Kylian Mbappe. A routine save. Milan showing good width. And he's got the beating of his opponent. Well, what a stop that was. And did just enough defensively. minutes left for play now not the best challenge and in the back of the net for PSG that lead extended to two now well 
Here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and when he gets onto it, he holds off the challenge, keeps his balance, and makes good contact with the ball. That's a top-class finish. Teo Hernandez now. Lorenzi. Benassa. On the ball, Rafael Leal. Benassa. Oh, he's given it. The referee says penalty. And an opportunity for them to pull one back here. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty yes, yellow card no. Can they get one back? A goal! Accurate from the spot! Let's take another look. He deceives the goalkeeper really well here by hitting the dive one way before placing it into the opposite side. A really good penalty. Well, how about this? 4-3. Dembele. Decides to shoot. Yes! And surely that's the end of the story. They cannot throw us away from here. Well, here's the replay. And just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Another side shy about shooting in this match. Who can they pick out? And swept out of there. Dembele. That was going in. Davide Calabria. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. And he takes it away. Loftus cheek. Teo Hernandez now. Benassa. Lorenzi. Well, that's a fine looking pass. Full time! Parisian pride shines through! PSG have cleared the final hurdle in the Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great thing, and what an achievement for them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners... Paris Saint-Germain. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories.
would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. These are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.